Hello everybody, welcome to Kawasaki Versus, where I, on my main bike, the Kawasaki, right now it's my main, and we'll bring in a new bike, I don't know, whenever Ian runs out of ideas, I don't know why I just refer to myself as a third person, but yeah, um, we're going to bring in the Kawasaki, we're going to do five laps on the Kawasaki, then we'll bring in a new bike, and we'll do five laps on the new bike, and see and compare times and ideal lap times and whatnot. So I'm not gonna be trying to set down any heaters considering I'm on four hours of sleep. And you know, it's the first time I'm touching a controller today. I already flopped this recording once about one and a half minutes into it. So it is a-okay. We still do have a lap up, so do not worry about it. Didn't even get through my second lap. First one was a 53, whatever. We won't count that. We'll just act like that never happened. Or like you don't see that at the top of your video don't know how i'm alive right now honestly luck of the irish um hop into this corner and this will be our second lap around and um yeah i guess we'll really end up uh trying to put in probably a sub 52.5 i think would be a good time if i could ever play the game even close to what i played it like yesterday jesus christ we're in 169 laps on this track yesterday uh for complete fun i mean having some good conversations while playing it i mean that can really drag time along but more than i've ever played mx bikes in these last three months has probably played all of last night and yesterday so yeah it's not a good look for me personally but it is what it is we'll go ahead and try to round out this lap here pretty quickly pretty swiftly hop up over here want to try to get like i said sub 52.5 and we'll take the cheater line and it will still set up set us up a little bit better but yeah 42.4 on the first lap isn't bad but it's not great my best lap last night was it a 51.5 or 51.6 i think it's one of the two uh it could have been a 51.4 as well but i'm just not sure i couldn't be 100 percent because i don't know that is gonna mess my lap up so at this point, we'll just go for an ideal, or go for ideal lap, make that better, and it's not going to make this any better here. So, this lap is scrap. Go ahead and just move to the next one. Headed out of this 90 degree right here. I'm going to stay a little bit lower, go triple, go single, go head into here. For sure, up and over. Make sure to ease on the throttle there. Uh, that was close to being a better run and this lap like I said is scrap again. I mean honestly my uh, um, My anger Tendency or uh, not tendency. It would be tolerance is the word I'm looking for uh, It's really low right now four hours of sleep makes me an absolute grouch. I think that's a, a good word to really say it so uh, Yeah, I guess you guys are gonna have to, to deal with this for I guess a little bit here Definitely not one of my finest days. Uh, I woke up and uh, just, you know, just, you know, it, it. You don't know it's gonna be a bad day, but you know, something kickstarts it, and you're like, okay, that's that's stupid. And uh, yeah, just never the same. But did we pass an ideal on that one? I do not think so. I think this will be our last lap. I think that this will be the one. We'll call this the last lap. So. We'll have to try our best to improve, and all of a sudden now I just don't know how to do that. I didn't mess that up for 169 laps, and I say that with true confidence. And then, uh, yeah, head into a new day, and uh, you come out with new struggles. So that's really fun. I mean, that's my favorite part about this whole thing is it's just you know the point and the fact that you know you can just find new find new things about yourself every day, and that is that you don't enjoy. Um, you know running 169 laps on a track i just don't enjoy it because how much better did i really get i'm not that good i'm obviously ass considering everything that's happening right now so go up triple on off for the last lap here we just got to go probably as fast as we can okay yeah dig the front that's awesome and yes i am hopping on we are doing a yamaha versus a kawasaki today in case you guys uh, were curious or you guys probably just skipped ahead in the video you little warps but go ahead and cross the line for the first time try to kick off this this run right here of uh some significant laps that i'm gonna try to run uh, i'm not gonna try to do much different than i did on the kawasaki like gearing wise and we'll see how that fares because this bike 
is very different on Supercross than the Kawasaki. And uh, that even includes the whoops for sure. And uh, this inside right here, I had a, a person or two uh, bagging on me for using it yesterday. And I was like, what are you talking about? That line is significantly faster than going all the way to the outside. Please tell me I can land this, okay? Because I was actually running a little bit of a good lap. Uh, my first one here. I'm still riding a little timid, a little too careful in my opinion. But uh, it is what it is. Go inside. Should still be able to set me up for the next lap. And we basically, yeah, I think we already have a beat. No, I could be wrong, but I think our, no, we might not. I mean, I'm not sure. I wish I documented that lap. I think it was a 4-4 something, like a 4-4-6. So we might have already just beat it on the first go around. I don't think that this lap will be anything close unless we can get like a power and a half drive which we did through the whoops so that's a plus for sure but uh, another good run through here might help as well go up and then back down this yeah no i don't think we're going to be able to top that last lap here on this one not a good one uh, by far definitely have had better so um i guess yeah we're going to try to cap this one off hit a big line or two is a quad a little bit more possible on this one i don't even know if the quad would be faster i mean it's still just a generally fast line that i uh, stuck to i even qualified without any of the quads so hooray to me but like i mentioned uh please make sure to go watch that video it was pretty funny pretty uh pretty horrendous for me actually um I, that experience was just awful uh, I'm very sad I got to experience that. This thing is a tank through the whoops. I didn't even know that. That is a very bad corner for me for sure. Try to make it up here. Go over that. Try to get over this. A lot better. Go inside. Pump the brakes. Try to downside that the best I can. Kind of cut that the right way. Go a little bit faster through there. Might have cut the corner. I might get cuts for this. And it all depends on how well... I can corner out here, cut in as fast as I can there, 52-1, not good, I mean that's pretty much what I, qual I qualified with a 52-08 I think, so like a 52-1 I believe, it could have been like 52-008 or something stupid, but it was close to a 52-0, at least it was a 52-082 I think, I believe, so I don't know, man. It's it's a bit rough that I uh, qualified poorly, and I still made it. I mean, it's still amazing that I still made it when I didn't even think I had a chance. So good to know I'm still uh, still up there. I'm still running some good times. Spent a lot of time on the track, so I was really hoping I could push through and, and get it. But this track, in my opinion, didn't really suit much of my styles, but it had a lot of uh, things that if you just spend enough time on and work enough on, you can get well. And we're working on lap number four here. We got to set up for a big lap number five. We are entering right now. Go triple single on this. Get to this inside. Hop out here. Outside of this double. And then just make sure to get up that. Like right now I'm pretty good through that dragon's back for sure. Hop in down through here. Go inside in the whoops if we can. Absolutely gauging my throttle. I'm not really slamming on it. Or anything like that i seen or it seems to be the trick for these whoops for sure downside that the best we can get enough grip to get over that pop ourselves up and over that get ourselves here still want to downside this not that poorly yeah that'll probably scrap our yeah that's that's done so yeah we basically know now that the yamaha <laughs> is better than the kawasaki um i'm just kidding i've had so much time on this game uh, these last couple of days and on this track alone that I think I could hop on the freaking Suzuki and run a sub 52 if you gave me give me 15 laps to do that maybe we'll try that video later in the week but we'll definitely bring the 450 onto this track uh, sometime this week for sure I mean I'd really like to try uh, some of these bigger lines with the 450 um, <clears throat> but yeah that is probably going to be all for me hopefully you guys did enjoy this sort of concept tell me if you guys would like to continue uh cowie versus because i think that uh cowie verse whatever uh could be really fun and a potentially goaded series so um yeah i guess we'll have to uh see you guys next time consider leaving a like and subscribing i would really appreciate it and maybe we'll do a 10 lapper this time this video has been quite short 
and then if I could scrap laps early, you know, maybe cut some time out, I think that we could still make it around 15 minutes, but tell me how you guys thought about this video, or tell me, you know, if you guys have any more ideas to, to really implement into this thing, I'm, I'm down to listen to for sure, and uh, jump off the side of the track for you boys, I'll see you guys next time.